WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. And the forecast is looking pretty dry as we head through the next couple of days. If you want to get the car wash, have yard work to do, just want to be outside, it's going to be a green light, especially if you're doing any of this in the afternoon and evening. We're looking at high pressure from the west, really ensuring that we see Sunshine as we head through the day, the winds are going to eventually transition and become more southerly and that's going to bump our numbers into the upper 60s for an afternoon high. So we'll start off the morning with some chilly numbers uh, expecting to need that lighter jacket when the kids are heading to the bus stop mid 40s. We'll get up to 51 by 9 and then as we head into the afternoon, the numbers get into that milder territory. I still call this a sweater weather type day. You're going to want something on your arms all day. I mean, we're going to struggle to get into the upper 60s. We'll get there for a couple of hours and then we're coming back down as we head into the evening. Lots of folks heading out to crabs and karaoke. Uh, it's going to be a nice little time here. 6 to 10 o'clock numbers will be in the upper 50s by the time this is uh, ending. So just remember it's going to get a little bit cooler through the overnight. Thankfully, southerly flow is going to rule the day for your Saturday. Remember I told you I expected the 70s to come back. 70s are in the cards for us as we head into your Saturday afternoon. A couple of high clouds push in as we head through the second half of the day. But even whenever folks are getting out for uh, the Baltimore Running Festival starts at 8 a.m., we're going to be at 52 degrees. This is pretty manageable for runners. Normally uh, they can handle that 60 degrees by 10 and then into the low 70s by the 2 o'clock hour. We'll hang out there for a while before the numbers cool back down. But even a milder start to your Sunday. Starting off above 50 sunshine for the morning, but the clouds will be increasing through the day becoming cloudy through the overnight. That's going to mean that our start to your Monday is going to be a little bit warmer. We'll start off today at 51 degrees and only getting to 64 because we're watching this cold front that's going to push through the area. That's going to bring clouds and a chance for some showers and behind that cold front, unfortunately, is that big drop down to 55 degrees, breezy winds, and then the 30s come back into the cars. Now we're talking 37 in Baltimore. That means Folks uh, north and west of the city could be in the low 30s, so we could see our first frost and freeze advisories for some of our viewers in places like Carroll County, Frederick County as we head into your Wednesday morning and Thursday morning as well. Thankfully, temperatures rebound back to 60 by Thursday, and we've been keeping an eye on Carl. It's been struggling. Winds right now sustained at 45 miles per hour. It's moving to the southeast. Going to make landfall in Mexico.